Hey, I noticed a lot of people are having trouble trying to install Pro Builder and Pro Grid, so I'm just making this to help you. For reference, I am using version 2020.2.4 F1. It shouldn't work for you, even the other versions. So what you want to do is you want to go to Window, go to Package Manager, then up here you want to make sure you select Unity Registry and then you want to click this gear icon go to advanced project settings then make sure this enable preview packages is checked then click I understand and then close that now you should type the word type pro in a search field and then you should see pro builder and pro grids so let's take pro grid builder and let's install that I notice up here there's no tools uh, file menu, but there will be when you install these. It might take a while to install. Then you can go up here to Tools, Pro Builder, and select Pro Builder Window to bring up the window. If you can right click it, you can switch to icon mode, and then you can dock it wherever you want. And then you want to go back to Window, the Package Manager again and select Pro Grids and install Pro Grids. Alright, once that's done it might automatically pop up, but if not, you can go to Tools, ProGrid, and ProGrid's window, and then this will pop up as well as this. And if you hold down Alt and hit this button, this will pop up and allow you to choose cube, plane, whatever you know you want to do. And you can choose a size, but you know, also if if you just build it and you want to change it, that's fine. Up here, you can choose the face tool, select your face, and you can bring it out, you know, or whatever. Um, you can do the same thing with the uh, the lines. I forget what they're called right now. Um, you can do the same thing with the axes or vertices, or I guess whatever. Um, and move the whole object itself. And notice how it's moving half a grid space at a time. You can adjust that up here, change it to one and do one grid at a time or whatever. Usually stick with 0.5 by default. And that's pretty much it. That's how you do that. Thanks for watching. Later.